throw you out. I got you, bro. Hold up. Got you. Oh yeah, dog. Got them. Even though it's Vegas winter time, we still gotta get them day spots in, you know? Even if it's in front of the shop. Fuck it. You know, when the money gets slow, we start using them Rustos and bust out the adapters and shit. Sometimes, even us, we can't use the fancy paint. But nah. I like using Rusto when when the shit like this doesn't matter. It's gonna get covered up. So it's a Lego cap on a blue adapter. What up, G? Little tip for y'all beginners that took me a while to learn was. Try to thicken up your outlines, and I'll sh you guys will see right now why. Instead of doing single outlines, go back and do a double outline around all your letters. Watch, you guys will see right now. Oh shit. My landlord is probably about to come and scream at me for doing graffiti out in front of his store. Like, yo, calm down, kids. Doing all that shit. Watch. About to show you why I, why I do that. So we go back here. Uh, let's grab some of the nice paint. Shall I think yellow? Yellow, this is my stash of caps for myself. Can never go wrong with this cap, bro. This cap is a shit right here. It's brand new, but it's my new friend. We didn't get it. Came, did we? No, it hasn't came in yet. Because they took it. Shit, it's been like a week, a week and a ago. half. Yeah. Well, I called them. They said they'd have one here today. Yeah, we haven't they got it yet. They usually pick it up early in the morning, don't they? Yeah, they do. Okay, I'll call them and have them get it out here. Okay, thank you. For now, it'll be Thursday before they'll do it. So. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Chap's been letting us uh, throw our stuff across the street, so we're fine for now. The next giveaway, um, I'm actually not sure, man. I was just talking with uh, somebody, somebody um, like yesterday or two days ago about doing another battle for some giveaways. Yo, what up, G? Um, so doing another battle. Um, this so we want to we want to get that running you know you gotta remember in the cold you gotta shake the shit out of these cans i usually never shake my cans but what up what up so the next event is actually going to be next first friday um we're already going to start prepping for it 
We only have issues with them, with the Vegas, simple Vegas Chapels place. Um, they kind of don't like the graffiti and all that. So I'm going to talk to them. Anyways, we got the landlord's blessing. So we're good, but I just want to be a good neighbor, you know, and let them know what's going to go down. But, so th this is the plan. Since I got y'all here, is we're going to set up. I want to set up walls down this whole lane right here. So, doom, doom, doom. All the way down to the fence. And we just kind of figured out how to do it with some pallets. So, that's kind of how we're going to set them up. Yo, what up, Benji? Um, so, set up pallets all the way down there. Have the artist painting. Probably have, like, one artist painting right here. Somebody that does characters or some crazy dope shit like that, you know? And then... It'll be like vendor, 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 you know, another vendor, so vendor, vendor, kind of like a couple vendors here, you know, four or five vendors and shit. Um, we want to push to get a, a DJ maybe. We were talking to the guys from the drop and they were showing a lot of a lot of support and showing us love and saying that they're willing to come down here and fucking get it popping with the help us out with the the dj maybe with the money we get from from the vendors pay for it or something you know and get this shit live and so that's just the little the little one right so if we get that going and it works what we want to do is we want to shut down the whole street we want to block the street off or block the alley off and get a whole fucking block party going you know for first friday take this shit back like been talking to a lot of OG writers and they told me how First Friday used to be more more, you know, graph. They're the ones who started it in the beginning. Well that's what I'm told. I actually don't know. But that's what I was told. And that's what we're trying to get it back to, you know. But what up dog? I was just in the alleys and I was peeping a bunch of your shit still up. Just out here, though, you know, painting. But enough about that. Let's get back to painting. So the reason I was telling you guys that you should do double outlines when you do your the outline of your letter is so when you go back with your force field, uh, outer outline, whatever you call it, you have enough room for error. Because if you just do the single outline, you know, if it would have been like just one, it would have been that thick. And I would have came in with this. And if I go in that much, I'm fucked, you know. I just erased most of my... This shit just moved. Oh, shit. It's dangerous, dog. We're fucking... We're gambling. We're gambling right now. This is about a free fall. So... If you don't do the double outline, like I, I had said, you don't have that much room for error, so your shit has to be perfect. And if you're like me, you're barely starting out doing graffiti, your shit is not perfect, bro. And we're far from being perfect, you know? But look how slick that is, yo. Little size. 13 or the 1st of December. Still do 12 shirts for 120. Yeah, bro. We still do the t-shirts for the 120. Hit us up, bro. It's our homie Days that does all that. But you can run it through us and we'll get it. We'll get it all sorted out for you. So you get that shit popping. Um, oh, yeah. So, I actually don't know what day it is, bro. All I know is it's, it's going to be the first. So, it's the first Friday of December. Whatever that date is, that's the day that we're going to do it. Um, well, hopefully, you know, plans don't change. A lot of bullshit's going on right now with the whole COVID thing. It's, it's getting a lot more hectic. Um, I've been beating meeting more and more people that have been affected by it if it's not by work or family members dying and all that 
so as long as the city's pretty much open we should be okay you know but we won't know till the day actually comes we got about a month still we didn't know about so the first friday just passed we set up we set up last minute we wanted to get it going and then all the crazy wind started coming through you know and all that shit so we had to call it a day but for the next one rain sleek snow whatever the fuck we're gonna get it going we're gonna get it you know you know what i mean uh this is a uh, cream cat from montana on a hardcore old school hardcore can that's why it looks so fucking dope so once you do your outline all your background shit oh once you do all that, you want to come back with your, what to do, what up, G? You come back with your fill color, and you want to clean up all your fill, you know? Make your fill look crispy and shit. Crispy it up a bit. Like, get rid of all this shit, get rid of all your drips. I probably picked the worst colors because I'm using a Rusto. So it's just. The overspray does not forgive you with Rusto, guys. So I always keep that in mind. That's why I, I kind of really like sticking to hardcore or anything. Anything uh, German valve, you know? Where I could use my caps and everything. Have a little bit. A little better control of where my paint and overspray is going because this shit is not fun when you're trying to have nice and crispy letters and get down with some flex and you got these bullshit fucking cans just overspraying over everything fuck you know it gets a little annoying but we do what we can with what we got sometimes Today we got this. Let me see. I just go off and start talking shit. And then I, I go back and untalk the shit I just talked, which makes no sense. But you guys get what I'm saying. That's the only thing that matters. I don't know if you could tell, but. Da, da, da. Where the fuck you at, dog? <laughs> Damn, hella saw I would have been been caught slipping already, dog. The adapters are three bucks, bro. What up? What up? <laughs> See, bro, I can't even. I can't even go back to painting now. I'm all fucking paranoid. I think somebody's behind me and shit. All those legal walls got me all all cooped up on the normal. On that normal life, you know, where you didn't have to watch your back or look back or anything. Right. <laughs> Too bad not to die. In painting or just chilling or what? So once you get that down, you come back with your outline color. Crispy that up a bit. Piece of shit. Once this video is over, I'm going to throw this can away because it's fucking trash. I'm over here trying to drop this nice little flex video on y'all, you know? And then my cans are cooperating, dog. Fuck this. All right, where we at? Where we at? So that looks a little better. Still looks like trash. Come back right here. Do some little, little details. Little crispiness. You see this? You want to? You don't want little bulby lines. You want nice little sharp lines. Look at that fucking overspray dog. I'm about to have a fucking meltdown right now because it's rust out. All right, whatever. Looks good enough. If you are at a, if this was a spot, 
you would have dropped this shit, nobody could tell about your overspray 20 feet away. <laughs> For sure. You know what I mean? Oh, you see this? Bam! Come back with the save. And then, before you leave the spot, you gotta hit it with that 20. Hit it with the 20. Hit up the homie rider. <laughs> Alright then, I'm gonna go inside because it's cold. Peace.